பாரதிய வித்யாபவனில் குலாபதி முன்ஷி விருதை பாரதிய வித்யாபவன் தலைவர் கிருஷ்ணராஜ் பானவர் ஆகியோர் வழங்க ஜி டி நாகிடு அறக்கட்டளை நிர்வாக இயக்குனர் ஜி டி கோபால் பெற்றுக்கொண்டார் அருகில் பிரிக்கால் நிறுவனர் விஜய் மோகன் சாந்தி ஆசிரமம் தலைவர் கேஸ்வினோ ஆரம் பாரதிய வித்யாபவன் துணைத் தலைவர் நாகசுப்பிரமணியம் இணை செயலாளர் சூரிய நாராயணன் பொருளாளர் அழகிரிசாமி உள்ளிட்டோர் கலந்து கொண்டனர் Now he is receiving this after a gap of 12 years. After all, it is human nature that we want to achieve something in life and get some recognition. It's natural. Nothing wrong. But that all of us try to succeed in life. All of us try to succeed in life. But not all succeed. And out of the few who succeed, only succeed through fair means very important then out of that only a few sustain the success and and out of that a few give meaning to that success This started from a very young age. To understand how this happened, we have to go a generation earlier to the late Mr. J. D. Nairn. As I said earlier, even though Mr. J. D. Nairn came from a humble rural background, and for all right people, he did not have any form of education. He was a self-taught man. He did a lot of work. but unrecognized there's a small there's an individual who has diffused silicon networks in Coimbatore and he has done it all by himself nobody knows about him there's a long place which was given to a, a individual in Coimbatore the professor in Coimbatore and they don't think he really knows about it and of course it was not uh, accepted in the opportunity for that uh, to be able to accept the professor to accept the Nobel Prize so nobody knows about it but he was nominated for it and John Gilmore was so proud of it that he did not have the Nobel there are many others that uh, who are doing this work who are doing this work Thank you.